Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. Today I thought I'd kind of vlog my day. I'm doing some errands and kind of cleaning the house, but I really wanted to show you a makeup haul and I thought it'd be more fun to do more of like a relaxed version instead of my usual setup. We're in the same room, my bedroom, but I've got my stuff from Ulta and Walgreens. I'm gonna show you what I got. So the first thing I got, which is really exciting, is this adorable palette. It's a Pirates of the Caribbean limited edition highlighting palette from Lorac, which I didn't even know that was coming out, but it's so cute. It's got this really pretty detail on it. It's so pretty. It's really nice and thin. And then inside, let me show you guys. It's gorgeous colors. There's some blush colors and then highlighting colors and then a really big mirror. Oh, there's my hand. And in the mirror, it says, chart a course for the stars. So it's kind of like a starry night. It's really pretty. And I'm actually wearing um, one of the highlighting shades today. And it's pretty like blinding for what I usually wear, but I really like it. And it's this um, second shade right here called Destined. And it's really pretty. And I really love this. And I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me using some of these products if you guys are interested in that I think I'm gonna be filming that pretty soon so I got this this um, retails for $30 at Ulta I don't think it's sold at Sephora and then I also got the Tarte make believe in yourself palette which is part of their unicorn collection which I really love the packaging is beautiful it's got nice pretty gold mirrored packaging in the back and this pretty like watercolor geometric pattern in the front which is so pretty and I'm sure a lot of you have seen what it looks on the inside but if you haven't it looks like this it's like this pretty color wheel of shimmery beautiful shades from some really pretty warm shades to some fun colorful shades and there's one matte shade for your crease and a lot of people might be like, oh, that's a lot of shimmer for one palette. But for me, I'm wearing it today, um, like the purple color on kind of like the inner corner to the middle. And then I just use the matte shades to kind of um, deepen it. And so I think it's a really fun palette to just grab when you want some fun shimmers. And then you just add on your matte shades when you want. Um, so this retails for $40. And I ended up paying $37 for both. And I ended up even getting a mini version of Benefit Highlighter, Cream Highlighter in What's Up. I don't know if you can see that, but it's a little adorable, cute. And I just asked, I was like, you know, when I was checking out, I said, do you have any free gifts for the Tarte palette? And she said, no, but we have this benefit, what's up? And I was like, sure, I'll take it, <laughs> you know? And so I think it's a really good idea to just ask, you know, if you have any free gifts for what you're purchasing. And sometimes they'll give you stuff that doesn't even go with what you're buying. Um, but how I got both of these products for $37 is I had a coupon for 20% off your entire purchase and that is just for platinum members and it's only in your email so make sure you check your emails it doesn't come up on the app it is in your email so when I know I'm gonna be shopping at Ulta I just like go through my emails and see if Ulta has given me any kind of like discount and then I use it and I also had $20 worth of points the next things I have are from Walgreens and Walgreens has a similar point system but it's way better you get a lot more points way quicker um and right now they actually have or they just started doing like a beauty enthusiast i think this video isn't sponsored by them i just i use walgreens all the time i'm there all the time and you actually get for every 50 dollars you spend in makeup beauty i think like skincare and hair care you get 5,000 points so, you know, if you're saving that up, you can get a lot of points pretty quickly. Um, and you can get points, you know, everyday items too, um, which is really nice. And sometimes you'll get random coupons for like 7,000 points if you spend $20, you know. You just kind of keep up with that and you can really get 
a lot of money off your purchase and so I ended up saving about 45,000 points and that equals up to $50 and I actually um, bought all this stuff online because they sometimes have a lot more or a lot of different products than they don't have in store and they have free shipping when you purchase online so I think that's a great deal and a lot of things I got were buy one 50% off which saves a lot of money too and so I'm going to show you those things really quick um the first couple things are by Maybelline and they are I think you can see that um a couple of the new brow precise products and this one is the brow precise fiber volumizer in blonde and it's really neat let me see if I can open this up for you it's basically like if you have thinner brows um it's kind of like a weird ovally shaped thing <laughs> but it gives some fibers into your brows and makes them look fuller and I think that's really nice I'm gonna leave all the products down below too so you guys can check them out but Maybelline was buy one get one 50% off when I purchased these and then I also got the brow precise perfecting highlighter in the shade light and this is a really unique product because um, you know if you want to um, conceal underneath your brows this is like square shaped so it's perfect for going right underneath there to really um, define your brows and I really like that I use both of the products today and I think my brows are looking pretty on point um, I also use my Anastasia Brow Wiz in soft brown so I really like these products I also picked up the Physicians Formula Butter Blush and I ordered this in Natural Glow, I think it's the other shade, but they sent me um, Plum Rose, which is kind of odd, but it's a really pretty color too. I used that today as well. Um, and it's like, uh, it smells like the Butter Bronzer, if you've ever had that. Very coconutty, tropical, very pretty, just a very natural color. Got a little bit of a cooler undertone to it, which I don't have a lot of blushes that are like that. So it's nice, you know. Um, and then I got this 99 cent uh, Wet n Wild brush. This is the contour brush and I like the pink tip. I think that's really cute and it's just all white. And it's really good for just getting a precise contour. And the next few products I got are some skincare products and they are by the brand Botanics. Really cute packaging. And I believe this is a like a British um, company because it says that um, it's by the Boots company which I believe is a drugstore in the UK if I'm not wrong I'm pretty sure that's what it is and this is the shine away with willow bark iconic clay mask for oily and combination skin and it's kind of small it's kind of a small product to be honest but um, I'm really excited to try this and then the two other products actually have my bathroom because I use them this morning um, but I got a facial scrub and a body wash and I, it's like around the same line I believe or like because they have different this is the scrub and it has the willow bark in it as well so I think it's to kind of help mattify your face there you go focus um, but this is really nice it was kind of like Dermabrasion, mycodermabrasion, if you've ever tried that. Um, very fine scrubbies in it, which I really like. And I'm kind of reaching in my shower <laughs> to show you the last thing I got. And this is the Mediterranean Eden, Eden with Orange Blossom Energizing Body Wash. And this smells really good. It smells like the um, energizing orange scent from Bath and Body Works, if you've ever tried that. It smells pretty similar to that so I really like it um, I really like all the products that I got and I ended up spending everything for um, at Walgreens for eight dollars like that's pretty awesome all those products I got for eight dollars so in total I ended up spending forty five dollars 
for all the beauty stuff that I got, which I think is really cool. So make sure that you are checking your email for Ulta coupons and you're saving those point coupons from Walgreens because they make a difference. Um, so now, today, I've got a project that I need to accomplish today, even though it's really gross and rainy outside. I really don't want to go outside today, but I have to get, pick up a few things at the grocery store, and then I'm going to show you this little project that I'm working on. There's a funny story that goes to it. It's kind of like an annoying story, to be honest, but a couple months ago, our, I'm probably echoing right now because I'm in our bathroom our guest bathroom. But a couple months ago, our washer um, just broke. And I was like, oh man. Because unfortunately, this house, it's an older house. This house was built in 1912, but this addition, like the bathroom that I'm in right now, um, was probably built in like 2003, 2004. But when they built the house, they apparently built the washer and dryer, like they built the bathroom around the washer and dryer. So we couldn't take out the washer and dryer through the doorway because the doorway is too small. And the day that it broke, I was like, I'm gonna do all this work to get this washer out. So we ended up having to take like the whole door frame and everything to get the washer out. And then we had to replace it and like i'm going to show you kind of what we had to do um like all of this was expanded about five inches we have a really good friend family friend who did everything for us which was so nice um but he had to put in a new door frame a new door and then this was like like right here you can kind of tell with the grout but there was like a wood kind of transition that he took out and then he put the tile down. And um, like weirdly, there's like a different tile here than there is in the bathroom. So that's kind of weird. So we had to kind of put this tile here to kind of transition into it. So now, and he had to like, you know, remove the little electric outlet thingy over um, because, you know, the trim was in the way. And this one too. So today I have to get this color paint which is need knitting needles at Sherwin Williams and I have to paint this so not a big deal it's been kind of a lot but um finally getting it finished and the only thing that's left to do is that this door doesn't close all the way because the trim comes out so he's got to cut that down right there and then the door will close but I've also got to paint the door as well because this is like off-white um, and I've got to paint it like the trim color which is like bright white. So I'm gonna have to go to Sherwin Williams today and I did save like all my paint colors because we painted every single room in this house but I went outside that was three years ago I went to our shed outside and they had all like solidified like they were like congealed or something. I was like, dang it. So I've got to get a little like sample bucket of this color and then that will be finished. And then I've got to paint the door. But yeah, this is our bathroom. I mean, I don't know if I'm ever gonna do a house tour, but this little toilet. I love this picture of Josh. I took this in Germany. You can see it very well, but he's petting a cow on his like, by his grandmother's house in Germany, which is so cute. Love it. And then, so this is where the washer and dryer are. They're right in here. And then these, all these little prints are from Hobby Lobby. So cute. I bought them when they were 50% off. And we actually painted these stripes too in here before we moved in, which I think are really cool. My sister-in-law helped me do it. Shout out to Rachel. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that paint sample or that little thing of paint and then I've gotta get some groceries and then I'm gonna come back here and finish that little project. So I'll see you guys then. All right, I made it back. My hair is officially gross because I was out in the rain, but I got my groceries. I got my paint. 
and I got my lunch. Delicious chicken and rice soup. Whoa! And a nice chunk of cornbread. Perfect for rainy weather. Yum, ooh, and I got the crusty piece too. Delicious. I was really hoping that they would have chicken and pastry today, but I had chicken and rice, which is pretty good too. So I thought that would be really good for this kind of chilly, rainy day. So I'm gonna eat my lunch and then we're gonna start on our paint project. All right guys, it is officially time to paint. Here's the color, Knitting Needles, like I told you before. It's a gorgeous gray color. If you're looking for a gray for your house, I totally recommend that color because it's it's neutral, but it has a little bit of a more cooler undertone, which I really like. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. I've already taped off my trim here, so I won't get any gray on it. And I'm just gonna get started. I'm not a professional, do not claim to be. Um, I had a lot of help from my sister painting this house, so yeah, this might not come out perfect, but at least it will get covered up. And I usually get really messy when I paint, so hopefully just these little, little parts I won't get messy from. Alright, I think I've got this side pretty much done. I'm going to see how it dries and if I need to do like a little second coat or not. So let's move on to the side. There's not much to do here. All right, I think we're good on this side. Again, I'm gonna let it dry and then see if I need to do any touch-ups after that. <clears throat> but I heard a little doggy crying. Look at this. What's that? What is that? Huh? Mooney? You do not like the rain? Huh? Hi! Hi there! Do you not like the rain? No? Come here. Hi! Can you sit? Can you sit? Look! Hey, look at me. Can you sit? Can you stretch? Goodness. All right, let's take a follow. Where's the buckle? There we go. You want a treat? Let's get you a treat. Yes. Yes. Yes, you would like a treat. Yummy. All right, can you sit for me? Sit. Ah. Sit. Hey guys, it's the end of the night and I wanted to show you how everything dried up on the wall. It looks pretty good, if I do say so myself. See, now you can kind of tell the difference between the door and the trim, like the color's off. So I've got to still paint the door, but then I'll be finished. And now I think I'm gonna go take my makeup off and I think I'm gonna try that mask. Um, that I showed you in the hall earlier. So let's go to my bathroom.
wow, this mess dried really quickly. Look at that. It's awesome. But I am having like some irritation on my eye. Focus. Focus. So when I close it, it's like red and splotchy. And it's, I don't know, it's really dry. Sometimes I get um, allergic reactions from purple eyeshadow. And I don't think it was from the new um, Tarte palette that I got, but it might have been from the matte shadows that I used. So that kind of sucks. But I have some eczema cream that I can put on it. Look, guys, look at this. Look. Oh my goodness. Oh my good. Oh my goodness. But why are you so cute, though? Why are you so darn cute? Look at you. Luna, look at you. You're so precious. Yes, precious. So I'm gonna have this mask on for a little bit more and then head to bed. You like the smell. You like the smell of it. She loves to sniff my eyeballs. I have no idea why. <laughs> You're such a weird doggy. I love you. Does it smell funny? Does it smell like willow bark? That's what's in it. Oh, nice kiss. Nice kisses. I think I might make some tea and take this mask off and head to bed. So I hope you guys like this vlog. I know it was kind of random <laughs> me doing kind of random stuff but if you liked it let me know and if you want more let me know and i think i'm going to be doing some more home projects like painting that door <sighs> i really want to paint um like the outside of my screened in porch the exterior so i think i'm going to be doing that soon so if you guys like home stuff and like home decor hauls let me know because i'm going to be doing a lot of that pretty soon probably so I hope you guys had a blessed day and I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Say bye, Luna. Say good night. Say in Germany, we say tschüss. Tschüss.